I guess we'll do it like that. Hello, everyone. So I found some things to do. <clears throat> Luckily, I found some things for us to do that are free. They're free. I found free things. Okay. So, um, I found... The first thing I found was this thing called Finder's Keeper. It's, um... I think, a, like, a... I don't really know how to explain it. It was like a walkthrough thing. They had, like, some Halloween stuff there, and you could buy some stuff. You could walk through. Walk through. This one was not free, but it was super cheap. It's on September 10th at 1406 Key Street, Maumee, Ohio, 43537. September 10th at 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. Now you can look this up. It's called Finders Keepers, and it's in Maumee, Ohio. Now, um, it cost $5 to get in, um, and children under 12 are free. So if it's just you and your children under 12 years old, it's only 5 bucks for you to get in. If it's you and your husband and your children who are under 12, it's only 5 bucks for you and your husband each, so $10 to get in. So we're going to go to that on the 10th. And then, on September 23rd, in Toledo, Ohio, they're having a <clears throat> Toledo Museum of Arts Festival. It's a glass harvest festival. You can go there and you can look at all, all these glass um, objects, glass blown, I think, objects, pumpkins and stuff, all spooky stuff, Halloween stuff, obviously. Um, it's free to the public as well. This one is free to anyone who wants to come. It is um, on September 23rd from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. Um, and it's 2445 Monroe Street, Toledo, Ohio, 43620. On Saturday, September 23rd at 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. Free to the public. You can get in for free. For free. <clears throat> so we're going to go to that on September 23rd. We got that on September 10th. Those are the Saturdays that Erica are is here. Saturday. One's a Saturday. And one's a Sunday when Erica is over at our house. So there's those. And then I also found a trunk or treat on October 6th. It is at an Allstate, I think. It's for Allstate customers. Or if you're not a customer, it's free to the public. Allstate customer or not. <clears throat> It's at 2680 Woodville Road, Road, Jesus, Northwood, Ohio, 43619. And it's October 6th at 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. Free to the public. So we're going to that on October 6th. Um, and then I looked up some pumpkin farms. We usually always go to Felix. Um, I figured maybe we can incorporate maybe another one this year in, um, like the Michigan area. So, um, I did actually find one, um, in, what is it? Where is it? It is in Erie, Michigan. It starts being open on September 7th. Get the fuck out of here. Sorry, my cats are pissing me off. So it starts on September 17th and it goes through October 31st. 
Um, it's closed on Mondays. They're open from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. Free admission and parking. It's cash only if you want to ride rides or buy pumpkins or anything else, etc., etc. You know, snacks, drinks, you know, those kind of things that are extra. But it is free to get in, but you'll have to have cash for those extra things that you want. Um, it's at 1560 East Stearns Road, Erie, Michigan, 48133. <clears throat> so I found that. I think we're going to go to that on October 7th. Which is a Saturday that Erica is here. Sorry, I'm just trying to look at all my calendars to make sure that's legit. Um, and then we are going to still try to go to the Ohio State Reformatory um, for their event, Escape from Blood Prison, Haunted House. Um, I have some information for that, too. We're going to go to that on October 21st, which is a Saturday that Erica is over here. Um, <clears throat> the information I have for that is it's at 100 Reformatory Road, Mansfield, Ohio, 44905. They are open September 29th through October 29th on Friday, Saturday, and Sundays. So every weekend throughout those days, September 29th through October 29th. Gates on those days will open up at 6.45 p.m. Tickets are sold online only. You have to pick time slots. The earliest time slot they have is 7 p.m. The latest one they have is 11.30 p.m. The general admission tickets are $35 plus a $5 fee plus taxes. Okay. The Ultra Lightning Pass is $75 plus a $5 fee and taxes as well. You have to sign a waiver. Um, you can get touch passes for an extra $7, but you must be 18 years or older. Kids 10 and up can go to this haunted house. Now, I'm just going to tell you prices. So prices for one ticket with no touch pass is $44.81. That's with the taxes and the $5 extra fee and all those fees and taxes. That's the uh, current total. That's the exact total. $44.81 for one ticket, no touch pass. <clears throat> then, if you want the Ultra Pass, the Ultra Lightning Pass, one ticket with a touch pass... <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry. I know what I did. If you want... Okay, so the first one... Let me restart this. Hold on, let me... Hold on. Okay, so one general admission ticket with no touch pass, I'm sorry, is $44.81. That is your total. After taxes and fees. That is your total. If you want one GA ticket with a touch pass, it is going to be $52.46, and that's with your fees and taxes, okay? Now, if you went with the Ultra Lightning tickets, um, one ticket with no touch pass is $88.59. 
or you could do one ticket with a touch pass and it's 96.24. So yeah, so we plan on going there October 21st. And then our last one will be October 22nd at Felix Pumpkin Farm. Or at least that's how I pronounce it. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Felix Pumpkin Farm. So that's open from September 5th to October 31st. Like I said, we are going on October 22nd. Um, it is open... Like I said, September 5th through October 31st from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. It's located at 7133 Seaman Road, Oregon, Ohio, 43616. Now, it is free admission and free parking. But if you would like to buy any snacks, drinks, pumpkins, or do any rides or mazes inside... You do have to pay, and I'm pretty sure it was cash only as well. I'd say take cash just in case. You never know. A lot of these places are doing cash only lately. But yeah, so we have our little agenda planned out for us going and doing that. So that's exciting. I have everything planned out. I have everything wrote down. Those are going to be fun. And I will go live for, let's see, we can go live for the Finder's Keeper. We'll go live for um, glass, glass Harvest. Um, we will not go live for the Trunk or Treat. Um, we won't go live for Blood Prison. We'll go live for Trebek Farms, and we'll go live for Felix Pumpkin Farm. So we'll go live for those four. And maybe we'll take Little One's friend with us to Felix Pumpkin Farm. <clears throat> but yes, that's our agenda for this Halloween. <laughs> Thought I'd talk to you guys about that and give you the information in case you wanted to go and see it. You can find any of these places online um, if you want to look at more information or whatever. But um, you have the Finder's Keeper. Let me just remind you of everything. You got the Finder's Keepers. Um, in Mommy, Ohio, you can just literally search Finders Keepers, Mommy, Ohio. Boom, I'm sure something will pop up their website or some information for you. You got your Glass Harvest in Toledo, Ohio. You can search that and something will pop up. You should be able to find it real easily. Um, you got your Trunk or Treat at 2680 Woodville Road, Northville, Ohio, Northwood, Ohio, 43619. Sorry, let me repeat that address because I messed it up the first time. 2680 Woodville Road, Northwood, Ohio, 43619, October 6th, 5.30 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. I don't know if you can Google that, so that's why I give you that address. Um, and then you got Felix Pumpkin Farm <clears throat> in Oregon, Ohio. You can literally search that up. Felix Pumpkin Farm, Oregon, Ohio, and it'll give you all the information you need to take you to their website. And you got... Um, the Tribeck Farms in Erie, Michigan. You can literally search up Tribeck Farms, Erie, Michigan, and boom, you'll get all the information you need for that. 
I also found, but I don't think we're going to go to it. I also found this one called BJ's Pumpkin Farm. It says it's open from September on September 16th to October 31st at 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. It's free admission and it's in Temperance, Michigan. So you could easily type in BJ Pumpkin Farm temperance michigan and you'll find all that same information that i found um i don't think we're gonna go to it this year but it is a good spot it seems like a good spot for kids and families to go and have fun depending on where you live and how close it is to you or how far you're willing to travel and then of course blood prison you can easily search Escape from Blood Prison, Mansfield, Ohio, and boom, you'll find their website and it'll bring you up all the information, where you need to buy tickets, and everything I told you about tickets. Um, so yeah, there's that. <laughs> I feel like I'm sponsoring them. They are not a sponsor. These are just places that I'm going that I am willing to tell you guys about so that maybe you can go and check it out if you live in the area. Or if you are willing to travel farther than what you, you know, depending on how far you're willing to travel as well. Some people are willing to travel miles and miles and miles for certain things. So this is why I give you these information. This is why I'm letting you know. And yeah. So we will have some stuff planned. It'll be Vlogoween from September 1st till October 31st. We will be doing vlogging. We will do spooky stuff. We will talk about spooky things. We will tell ghost stories. We will do all kinds of things. We're going to have so much fun when it comes to the spooky season. Let me just tell you. Um, that's all, folks. That's all I got for you for now. On that. Um... Anyways, what else are you guys up to? What are you guys doing today? Um, a lot of you are probably still at work and school and stuff, so that's fun. That's always fun. Um, we will be doing fun things in... Um, winter as well. I know I keep talking about Halloween. Um, but we'll do fun things in winter for Christmas. Even though I despise Christmas. But we'll do some Christmas decor hunting and we'll um, do some other stuff. Christmas sale stuff. <sighs> But that's for a whole nother day and time and looking up. And we've got a long time before we need to look all that up. So that's always fun. But we'll find some stuff that we can all, you guys can go with us or whatever. We can vlog and we'll do some fun stuff. Oh my gosh. I'm excited for Halloween. We've literally got, today is Tuesday. we got Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday is September. The beginning of Halloween. To me. And to most of us other people out there. If you think about it. A lot of us Halloweeners are like. Halloween starts on September 1st. <laughs> I am one of those people. I he hence the spooky creepy music in the background. Um, I'm going to pause for a little bit. So I can smoke a cigarette. I'll be right back with you guys. It'll be like two seconds to you. Me, it's like ten minutes. Okay, we are back. So we're just hanging out, waiting on Mysterious E to get home. He should be home at any time soon. I need some water. I'm out of spray. I ain't got no caffeine. Can't have no more caffeine today anyways. But I ain't got no Sprite. I'm out. He's gone, Zoe. He's gone. He's empty. So I'll be back. I'm gonna go get some water. I don't know what it is, but I don't feel good. 
Honestly, I feel like crap. And I'm not sure why. It's not great. I feel really, 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 really bad right now. Maybe I'm just tired. I don't know. <clears throat> I got some water. So we're drinking our water to try to feel better. Maybe it'll help some. Anyhow, this is going to be the last one of the day. Um, we're going to watch Monday Night Raw today. Probably going to do some more crying today. If they even mention Bray Wyatt at all, it's going to bring me to tears. If it's anything like Friday, it's going to be... I don't know. Some might be some tears tonight on Monday Night Raw. <laughs> Who knows? Um, <clears throat> but if there is, it's okay. It's okay to mourn someone. It's okay to cry. You know? Halloween spooky cup. Water in our spooky cup. <laughs> I love our water. I used to not drink water a lot. But I need to. That's the thing is I need to drink it. <clears throat> Halloween spooky music is back. I had an ad, so I had to mute it. It's nice. Nice little background ambiance at spooky times. <laughs> We're all ready for Halloween, or at least I am. After this, I really have to look at some pictures of face paint to get some ideas. I think I want like a little diamond on my eye. Like maybe a black diamond or some kind of illusional looking diamond or something spooky diamond vibe. And then still like the mouth up to you know as open as it'll get but I want to make it look more realistic like there's teeth and you know what I mean I want to make it look like that that was a cool trick of the light coming off of that truck it's just like sparking in my face and it looked like a Halloween filter vibe <laughs> We're gonna have so much fun. Oh, wait. I'm excited. I hope you guys are excited. As I said, we have lots of things planned. So, it seems like we're gonna have lots and lots of fun.
We have at least four definite things planned that I would love to go to. Maybe five or six, depending. But that's perfect. And then, you know, throughout the week when we're not doing, like, the pumpkin patches and stuff, um, we'll do something spooky vibes. We'll do, like, either ghost stories or, you know, something. We'll do some spooky stuffs. We'll do some spooky stuffs. It'll be fun. It'll be lots of fun. still have a bunch of Halloween decor hunting we will do too, so that'll be in there as well. <clears throat> it's not any different from our normal posting. We try to post every day anyways, <clears throat> so that'll not really change much, but it'll just be every day from September 1st till October 31st will be Halloween type content. Ghost stories, um, talking about scary movies, and talking about haunted houses, uh, going Halloween decor hunting. We will find a bunch of fun stuff to do every day that's Halloween y vibe. I swear by it. I have a computer. I have a phone, and I can do stuff to show you guys things for Halloween if I need to show you things. If I want to show you spooky videos or whatever, we'll figure it out. We got this, y'all. We got this. Maybe we'll watch other people do face paint or, you know. We'll figure it out. We will figure it out. Trust and believe that. Also, I have to try to do it certain if we're gonna watch videos or things together I have to do it certain ways so that we don't get copyrighted you know what I mean I have to do it certain ways like that as well but yeah you guys should see this screen I don't know if I can show you it properly you see it I don't feel like you guys can see it. Okay, there we go. Look at that little screen. Isn't that just the cutest? A little background for our spooky music. And isn't he just the loudest boy in the world? Where even are you? Are you around the corner? What are you doing? Liam. Come here. Now look, he's not coming here. But if I start whistling this John Cena theme song, he'll come over here. Come running over here. Watch. Come on. You're right there. He came running over. He was over on the stairs, and he came running over to say hello. And to say goodbye. So, yes, we are going to hop off of here. This is the last 
the video for the day, so I will see you guys tomorrow. If you could, please smash that like sub button so I know you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you are not already subscribed. Turn on that little notification bell so you never miss another video. And we will see you guys in the next one. Love you. Bye.